It's been quite some time since I last talked about the killing joke on this channel. Mainly because he really hasn't done anything of any significance for me to start paying attention to him again. Well, that's changed. Because you see, my friends, two days ago I received a, a DM from someone. And they had left me a link. Now the link in question leads to a, a mugshot of our boy, The Killing Joke. Saying how in 2015 The Killing Joke was arrested for domestic abuse. For hitting his poor little wife there. So I decided I was going to take that link, I was going to post it to Twitter. And I was going to tell everyone just... How much of a scumbag the killing joke really is. Now, it took the killing joke no time for him to come across my tweet. I left the link to his little mugshot. The same link I am going to be leaving in the description below. So you guys can have a nice little look at it. But what exactly did the killing joke say about my tweet? You must be wanting to do yourself well. His immediate response to the tweet was, Damn, I look sexy. I shit you not. Those were his words. And that's not all. No. Because you see, while the killing joke was commenting on my tweet, where I left the link to his mugshot, an arrest record, uh, the killing joke was live on stream. And he started talking about it. And he says, Wow, what a shock. I'm a scumbag. It's totally not like everyone already knows this. Which, uh... Yeah, that, that was something. That was very something indeed. Not the best thing to say when you are being exposed for being a wife beater, but it gets more crazy besides that. But uh, afterwards, you know, the killing joke, he started getting very, very angry, saying that because I posted a link to his mugshot and I'm exposing him for being a wife beater, uh, in the process, I have doxed a federal agent. But Killing Joke himself is not a federal agent. No, 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 no. He's not one of the glow-in-the-darks. His wife, on the other hand, at least according to the Killing Joke, that is, is a fed. And by me posting a link to the publicly available mugshot, along with the domestic abuse charge, uh, apparently, me doing that means that I've doxxed his wife, who is a federal agent. Which is interesting, because the last time I checked, his wife was a veteran who developed a breast cancer due to her being in relatively close distance to the Kuwait oil fields, which were on fire during Operation Desert Storm. I guess once she got back from Kuwait and served her country, she became a fed. But then the killing joke decides that since I doxed his wife by posting the link to his rap sheet, uh, he's going to take me to court. Which is very interesting for him to say, since he still very much intends to seize her Madame Antine, up in Chicago, uh, he really doesn't have that much money, so how the hell he's going to be able to afford to not only drag me to court, but fly out to Chicago to beat the shit out of Sir Adamantine for hurting his feelings on the internet? I don't know. He really doesn't get much in terms of donations on his streams anyway. 
So once that happened, me and the killing joke started having a little back and forth, and then eventually his wife, Anastasia, decides she's gonna jump on in. And she's gonna make a complete and total ass of herself. Now, during the course of this back and forth between myself, the killing joke, and the killing joke's wife, Medicare Fembot decides that she's gonna have a little fun, point and laugh at the killing joke. To which Anastasia, the killing joke's wife, uh, says that, you know, she, she really finds Medicare Fembot's voice annoying. And that his opinion, that her opinion shouldn't be on the internet. Uh, pretty much implying that the Killing Joke's wife thinks Medicker Fembot is actually Mr. Medicker. I should you not. Anastasia actually thinks that Medicker Fembot is secretly Jim in disguise. Kind of hilarious that she would come to this conclusion when Medicare Fembot's been docs for over a year now. There's pictures of Medicare Fembot around the internet. But I had a good giggle over it. And so did Medicare Fembot and countless others. But anyway, earlier today, me and the Killing Joke said we're going to have another back and forth. Uh, during the course of our conversation, uh, he more or less compares abusing women to getting laid. And in the killing joke size, if you don't hit women, you're a virgin. So you can fuck as many women as you want. If you've never hit one of them, you're a fucking virgin in the eyes of the killing joke. And aside from that, a man by the name of uh, Man Squatch decides he's going to start artistically screeching into the void and accuse me of doxing the killing joke via that little mugshot link. I kept trying to explain to the blubbering idiot that no... Me posting a link to a website which posts his mugshot and his arrest record is not doxing. If anything, mugshots.com doxed him. And well, if the killing joke didn't want to get doxed by mugshots.com, he shouldn't have hit his wife. So we start having a bit of a back and forth, but then Medicare Femba pops up and Leaves a little audio clip to the killing joke openly admitting that he has said his real name before countless times on stream, along with his wife. So Man Squatch quickly shut up. And here we are now. It's been an interesting 48 hours, to say the least. I've been preoccupied with what's been going on with Ukraine. But I decided to take a little break from that and... Well, have a little fun at the Killing Joke's expense once again. So I am going to be leaving a link to the uh, little mugshot of the Killing Joke there. So you can all see the docs of the federal agent who was not the Killing Joke. But he says that I'm doxing a federal agent anyway. Maybe I'll leave a link to a couple of uh, some tweets in regards to this ongoing shit show between myself and the Killing Joke so you guys can enjoy them. There's way too many tweets for me to actually read and do a video on. But I know, but regardless of what happens, I'm definitely going to be leaving a link to that mug sheet in the description below. So you can all have as much fun reading about that as I did. But anyway... I will catch you guys in the next video. Assuming, of course, we don't get nuked in the near future, okay? See you guys.